this is one of the best if not the best coffee I ever drink and this is from Maru Maru coffee uh, you can get it from my news cafe I think tapi tak semua my news cafe ada Maru coffee only on selected outlets yang ada provide this Maru coffee try it <coughs> Assalamualaikum and hi dalam video kali ini, saya akan berkongsi macam mana saya spend my first weekend of 2021 So, on 31st December malam tu hari Kamis malam I just read a news kat Twitter kalau tak silap Majlis Agama Islam Negeri Selangor dah benarkan untuk kita solat berjemaah Di semua-semua masjid, surau-surau dan juga untuk solat Jumaat Belum ni, I think certain area dah ada buat macam tu Cuma di Cyberjaya, both most dekat Cyberjaya They still close for public And Alhamdulillah, hari Jumaat pagi I started my first January 2021 Dengan solat subuh berjemaah Di Masjid Raja Haji Fisabilillah There's so many weeks And first January 2021 saya juga dapat solat Jumaat di Masjid uh, Cyber Jaya 10 Saya cuba register dekat mas, Masjid Raja Haji tu Tapi sekejap dia dah penuh So Alhamdulillah saya diberi peluang untuk register dekat Masjid Cyber Jaya 10 And ada slot yang available So that was my first time dekat Masjid Cyber Jaya 10 Which is a little bit far from my place compared to Masjid Raja Haji But again, there's always a first time for everything, right? So, yeah. And I really like the concept of that mosque lah. Sebab dia macam a very open concept. Concept dia similar dengan Masjid uh, Sultan Mizan dekat uh, Putrajaya. A very open concept. Cuma Masjid Sultan Mizan tu lagi grand lah. Masjid uh, Cyberjaya 10 ni, dia lebih kepada more on basic structure punya masjid. Dia akan tengok beam yang besi dekat dalam masjid. A very macam a naked construction punya type lah and sebelah petang kami memenuhi jemputan undangan uh, majlis perkahwinan uh, bekas uh, majikan kepada isteri saya ketika isteri saya masih dalam government sebelum ni sebagai pegawai takbir diplomatik Uh, our slot is sebelah petang uh, Pukul 5 Between 5 to 7 Alhamdulillah Dapat memenuhi jumpa, jemputan orang yang perkahwinan Terima kasih kerana sudi menyebut kami sekeluarga And then on Saturday Saturday morning saya tak ada buat apa Just duduk rumah Cuma sebelah petang tu I went to Shah Alam To meet my son and my daughter Muhammad Mikail and Nur Iman I bought Dunkin Donut for Mikael and Iman Hope they like it lah Assalamualaikum Masa sekolah badan bisi Tak boleh lah Iman Kenapa kamera tu dia point dekat Iman? Thank you <laughs> Oh say You <laughs> will know They live with their mother uh, Dekat Shah Alam So, I dah lama tak jumpa Almost since last year So di, di, uh, That was my first time Jumpa dia pada 2021 lah And one of the reason is uh, Saya nak bagi apa uh, Laptop pada my daughter Sebab untuk join online classes Etc et kan On Sunday So I went to Putrajaya untuk betulkan kereta Nak check kereta because dia ada satu bunyi Yang very irritating
bila start engine okey lagi tapi bila bila start engine and then switch on the aircon dia akan bunyi screeching sound so i went to the workshop and as usual bila sampai workshop uh, i tak boleh nak uh, apa buat balik nak nak tunjuk the problem to the mechanic dekat workshop dia tak ada that sound at all I shoot the video but then it's quite difficult for the mechanic to troubleshoot lah without having to experience or see the problem uh, at that time kan so because they dah check belting, they check belting okay and then they put some lubricants on the belting supaya just in case lah kan so okay lah, I cakap tak apalah nanti lah, I just monitor dulu lah then I went to car wash to wash my car dan lepas tu dia ada bunyi sikit lepas tu uh, tapi I tak pergi balik lah so I just biar dulu that's how I spend my first weekend in January 2021 for now I still tak I still tak allow my family or I still tak bring out my family untuk keluar pergi jalan-jalan dekat shopping mall so hopefully you guys also can exercise or can refrain yourself from visiting all the shopping malls bring your family out jalan-jalan which is unnecessary risk don't put a, an unnecessary risk to the family lah let's sacrifice a little bit not just for ourselves and also for our for for frontliners especially because they are working very hard to to treat the covid uh, 19 patients i think that's all see you when i see you